Well, that was a little thin. Is it going to work? Nope. <laughs> that felt a little better. I think the face is shut. Sure is. That one did not feel shut, but it was. All right, so I'm here just like hitting balls. I'm, I'm using my simulator. I've got this luxury of this awesome golf simulator, right? And you may have one too. Um, and I'm trying to figure out, you know, how to hit good golf shots. And my face is shut, my face is shut, my face is shut. But I'm just dragging balls over and continuing to hit shots. So, you know, one of the things that, about the simulator that's so nice is, you know, you can get this like immersive, fairly realistic golf experience and um, you, you have the opportunity, opportunity to make the most of it. So instead of me standing here just hitting a ball, raking another ball, hitting a ball, raking another ball, I'm gonna try to make this more like I'm practicing to get ready to play golf. Okay, now I'm not gonna play the whole golf course. I'm gonna keep hitting this shot, and this is number 12 at Augusta. All right, I'm gonna, I'm gonna keep hitting this shot, but I'm gonna practice my routine as I do it. All right, so first thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna get rid of all these numbers so that I'm not focusing on numbers, I'm focusing about hitting good shots. All right, so there they go, they're gone. Now, instead of me drag, going drag, hit, drag, hit, I'm gonna go through a pre-shot routine. And what I'll do here is, excuse my backside, I'm gonna stand behind the ball and I'm going to pick out a spot in front of my ball to line up my club face to. And since I don't really have much visible up there, I'm gonna put a T in front of my ball. I'm gonna use one of these little burr T T's and use this as an alignment aid. And when I play on the course, I'm gonna to try to pick something in front of my ball as well. I'm gonna go ahead and take the luxury of getting it exactly where I want it. So I'm gonna to try to start my ball right over that line, or more importantly, I'm gonna get my club face square to that spot, okay? Then I'm gonna set up. Right, I'm gonna look at the target, and on my mind, I wanna picture what I'm expecting the ball to do while it flies up towards the hole. In other words, I like to take a, like, a, like a target picture when I stand back here, right? When I get back here behind the ball, I'm looking at the flag stick, I'm looking at the entire picture. When I go to hit my shot, I'm gonna be in my swing. My swing thought is gonna be, I'm gonna be envisioning the ball flying to the hole. So by practicing on a simulator, I have the ability to do this and I can take this to the course. I'm also gonna accept the outcome when I'm done. I'm not gonna get freaked out over a bad shot. And I'm not gonna act like I won the Masters for a good shot. So here we go, let's see what we can do here. Let's see what we get. Well, it's curving left. My face is probably a little bit closed. Whoa, a little long. A little long and a little left. Now here's what's kind of cool. From practicing earlier, I'm not so sure that I used too much club. I think that my face was just closed. That made the ball go farther, right? So I'm guessing my face was shot. My path is probably a little bit to the right. Uh, I'm not even gonna look at the numbers. on. I'm just gonna go through the routine again. I'm gonna make a practice swing, a rehearsal swing. And I'm feeling in my rehearsal swing that face hanging open. I'm trying to feel in my, my rehearsal swing that, that that toe is lagging behind the heel because all day long I've been hooking everything. I'm gonna move the ball right exactly where I want it. Let's go. Picturing that ball flood I want. All right, that's a little right of the hole. I think my face is probably open a little bit. There we go. Now we're getting a little bit better, okay? So when you have the luxury of something like this, 
where you have this beautiful picture, right? Take advantage of it. Don't just hit and drag the same thing you would do at a driving range, right? Go through, through your routine. Once you realize that, hey, like today, me, my face is shut all day, make a little routine where that face is going to hang open a little bit, uh, and then try to put that swing on the ball. You know, th those hooks that I was hitting earlier, I wasn't doing that on purpose. It's just kind of the rut that I got myself in today, all right? And then I'm able to kind of work my way out of it by incorporating how I would play on the course along with a little bit of, you know, re repetitive, uh, you know, golf swing mechanics, stuff like that. All right, so take advantage of this beautiful picture you have so you can make practicing more like being on the golf course. I hope that helps. I'll see you next time.